This video is sponsored by Hotspot Shield, a VPN to protect your privacy, data, and freedom to browse censored websites. Hi everyone, this is Dave from Geek and Noise, and welcome to my continued coverage of the late 2013 Apple Mac Pro. And in this video, I wanna show you the I.O. ports on the back of the machine. I've actually turned it round at the moment, and just show you how Apple really do think out their designs. And later on in this video, I'm gonna show you the little party trick that they built into the Mac Pro as well. So first of all, let's have a little closer look at these ports on the back. Now, just down here, we've got the input for the power supply, so it is actually powered on at the moment. We've got the power on off button just here. Next to this, we've got an HDMI output. Then we've got two gigabit ethernet sockets. And then we've got not one, not two, not three, four or five, but six Thunderbolt 2. Uh, sockets as well and these can be used for things like storage uh, displays etc I use mine with a Thunderbolt display and the speed of these new Thunderbolt 2 ports is absolutely phenomenal and then just up here we have got four USB 3 ports I've got a little receiver plugged in here for my keyboard and then we've got uh, we've got an output here for speakers and also an output for headphones and then just to the right here we've got a little lock switch and it's actually locked at the moment but we can flick that switch around to the open position and then we can lift off the casing i showed you that in my unboxing of the late 2013 mac pro if you haven't seen that then please do check out the link in the video description and now i want to show you the little party trick that apple actually gave us with this new machine and that is that if you actually rotate the machine so let's imagine it was facing the opposite way and i'm turning it around to look at the back you can see that the sensor inside actually lights up all of the inputs and outputs. It's only something very small, but I just think that it's done so elegantly and it certainly does help you to sort of see the ports if you're working in a dark environment. And there you can see they've just turned off. I'm gonna do that again, but show you it in close up, just so you see these ports come on. So a slight movement to the machine and it knows that you've actually turned it around and it lights up those ports. I just think that is a really nice touch to the design. And I think Apple added that just uh, so elegantly and so nicely, I just absolutely love it. It's one of the really nice little party tricks that you can show people when you are showing off this really lovely design. Now this video is all about the ports, but I just want to touch on the actual casing. It's a lot more reflective than I thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to be like a jet black or a matte black, but it's a sort of almost a gunmetal finish to it. Very, very nice design and just very well engineered. So that's it for this video. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, please do hit that like button. Please subscribe to the channel and I'll see you all in the next one. Thank you very much for watching. If you want to see another video of mine, please do click the annotation on the top of your screen now. And also, you can click the annotation on the bottom of your screen and subscribe to the Geekanoids channel. Thanks for watching. I'll see you all again next time.